this journey has been truly unbelievable in so many ways and uh, we, we've been talking about about inclusion about reconciliation about youth involvement all these these values that are, are sort of inherent in the in the whole C3 journey yesterday in uh, in Hopedale there was a young man who came up to me when we were having lunch his name was Edmund and and he he said if I ever had it I told myself if I had, ever had a chance to meet Fred Penner I would and then a little later that afternoon in the middle of or towards the end rather of the cardboard boat race that's a whole other story in itself uh, he, he came up and he and he gave me something and I've got it inside this little piece of, na of handkerchief that I carry with me and Edmund came up and he gave me gave me this and he said my name is Edmund Sinclair and when he said Sinclair he looked at me like does that name ring a bell to you and Sinclair was the name and I, I seem to recall that the name of uh, a young lady who was murdered in Halifax three years ago uh, for her rent money and this was his sister and uh, and and he gave me this this piece because he felt so strongly about my involvement in his life when he was a child and positive things that he felt and and he wanted me to have this as as a thank you for what whatever I brought into his world and I think he, he felt that by giving this to me it was putting his sister in touch with the positivity that this whole journey of, of, of reconciliation, the whole C3 trip, was all about. So this, this became symbolic of, of this entire trip for me. Bear is courage in, in, in indigenous culture. So this courage I'm going to be carrying with me and, and certainly passing this on to, to anybody I can along the way. It was powerful to say the least.